Hello, everyone, and welcome to the DU Weekly Check-In. I'm joined by head women's coach, Lindsey Cool. And Lindsey, coming off the Tulane State All-State Sugar Bowl, um, had a lot of success on that course. You're returning back there um, for a dual play with Tulane. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, we actually leave next Monday over spring break to play Tulane in a dual match um, next Wednesday. We are playing them at Lakewood Country Club which is pretty close to English Turn where we just competed. Um, it's going to be a six people count five scores, so the low five scores. And so our whole team will be traveling to this week's um, event, both at Tulane and LSU over spring break. So we'll get to see Jess Cardi in the premiere in this yes, spring. exactly. And everyone. Yep. Um, and then on to um, LSU, the LSU Golf Classic. Um, you'll be playing at the University Golf Course. Um, another very talented field. You have number 20 uh, tournament host, LSU. You have number five, Arkansas. Number 15, University of Central Florida. Just a lot of top tier teams in the top 30. And what can we expect from the University Golf Course? Yeah, so five teams in the top 30, and then we're ranked 38th. So it's a smaller field, I think 12 or 13 teams. But like you said, it's another competitive tournament. And we look to see a lot of SEC schools, Southern schools, Texas schools down there. Um, but I think it's a really good test. LSU just, it was three years ago, just renovated their greens. So what I've heard um, is that the greens are pretty difficult, undulating and big. So we're doing a lot of work on our short game here in the week to, pre to prepare for that tournament. Okay, and then you have the Liz Murphy Intercollegiate, and then it's right into the playoffs with the Summit League tournament. Um, what do you have to accomplish at this LSU and then the Liz Murphy before that Summit League to be in contention? Yeah, I think um, the rest of our schedule this spring is very competitive, and I think it will prepare us going into postseason, going into the conference tournament and regionals. Um, so we look to have some top finishes, but really to – really concentrate on the, the process goals, what we've been talking about with our team and trying to get better every tournament. That's our biggest goal this spring is just to improve every tournament, work on our short game and our ball striking. So we really feel like this schedule really prepares us for the postseason and hopefully we'll be ready for conference and regionals come five or six weeks. Okay, thank you, Lindsay, and thank you for joining the DU Weekly Check-In for this week.